I want you to just let me know what's there for you right now. Just thinking about doing this. Um, this embarrassment. Move. Embarrassment. Where do you feel that in your body? Um, all over. Okay. Mm -hmm. So even though I've got this embarrassment, even though I've got this embarrassment, and it's all over, and it's all over, and I've already got tissues waiting, <laughs> and I've already got tissues waiting. I accept myself. I accept myself. Deeply and completely. Deeply and completely. Even though I'm already getting emotional. <laughs> That's not hard. I cry at ads. <laughs> Even though I'm already getting emotional. It's not hard. I cry at ads. I cry at ads. <laughs> I accept myself. I accept myself. Deeply and completely. Yeah, deeply and completely. Even though I've got this movie. Even though I've got this movie. That I don't know if I want to be exposed. That I don't know if I want to be exposed. I accept myself and all my fears. <laughs> I accept myself and all my fears. It's going to be great to get rid of this. <laughs> it's going to be so good to get rid of this. And I accept myself. And I accept myself. Deeply and completely. Deeply and completely. All these fears. All these fears. All this anxiety. All this anxiety. Being exposed. Being exposed. All this emotion. All this emotion. It will be good to get it. It will be good to get rid of it. Mm. All this emotion. All this emotion. All this fear, all this fear, all this nervousness, all this nervousness. Just thinking about the movie title. Just thinking about the movie. Title. I haven't even said it yet. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't even said it yet. Yeah. I haven't thought of it yet. <laughs> even thinking about thinking about the title. Ah, uh, even thinking about thinking of the title. <laughs> all this emotion, all this emotion. I want to process it. I want to process it. Mm -hmm. So take a deep breath. <sighs> All right, so how are you feeling? Just keep tapping me. Um, Do you, have you thought about a movie title? No, I haven't thought about a movie title. Okay, title. what's there for you in your body uh, right now? Uh, um, fear. Mm -hmm. Where is it? Uh, upper chest. Upper chest. Mm -hmm. So how about if we just call the movie title Fear? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So even though I've got this fear, I have not got this fear in my upper chest. In my upper chest. I accept myself. I accept myself deeply and completely. Deeply and completely. Even though I've got this fear in my upper chest. Even though I've got this fear in my upper chest. I want to process and release this. I want to process and release this. Doesn't belong trapped in my chest. Doesn't belong trapped in my chest. Or in my body. Or in my body. Or in my energy. Or in my energy. And I accept myself deeply and completely. I accept myself deeply and completely. Do you know? I just thought then. Right. I probably got mascara down my face. <laughs> 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 Even though I'm still vain. <laughs> Even though I'm still vain. <laughs> I accept myself anyhow. I accept myself anyhow. <laughs> okay. Thinking about this fear. Thinking about this fear, I accept myself. I accept myself, and I want to process it. And I want to process it. This movie title. This movie title. Fear. Fear. I'm feeling it in my chest. I'm feeling it in my chest. It's already processing. It's already processing. This fear in my chest. 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 When I think of the movie title. When I think of the movie title. This fear in my chest. This fear in my chest. Movie title Fear. Movie title Fear. Movie title Fear. Movie title Fear. 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 Mm -hmm. So take a deep breath. So I didn't ask it what it was out of, out of um, 10, but I presume it was about 10. <laughs> what is it now? It's about an 8. Mm -hmm. And is it still in your chest? Um, it's moved up. It's mm -hmm. moved up. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what's that feeling that's moved up a little bit higher? Is it, is it like a... Restriction, a choking, a what? A heaviness, a pressure. It's a weight, a weight. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So even though I've got this weight, even though I've got this weight that's moved up in my chest to my lower throat, um, that's moved up into my um, in, yeah into my chest to my lower throat. Mm -hmm. I accept myself. I accept myself deeply and completely. Deeply and completely. Even though I've got this weight in my lower throat, even mm -hmm. though I've got this weight in my lower throat, when I think about the title fear, when I think about the title fear, I accept myself. I accept myself deeply and completely. Deeply and completely. Even though I've still got some fear and a heavy weight in my lower throat, even though I've got some fear and heavy weight in my lower throat, when I think about this movie title, when I think about this movie title, fear, fear, I accept myself deeply and completely. I accept myself deeply and completely. This fear, this fear, 
this movie title fear, this movie title fear. It's a heavy weight in my lower throat. It's a heavy weight in my lower throat. A heavy weight in my lower throat. It's a heavy weight in my lower throat. Processing, releasing, processing and releasing. It's heavy weight in my lower throat. It moved. Uh huh. Boy, too. My heart. Mm -hmm. All this fear in my heart. It's fear in my heart. I want to process it and let it go. I want to process it and let it go. This fear in my heart. This fear in my heart. Processing and letting it go. Processing and letting it go. Mm -hmm. This fear in my heart. This processing and letting it go. Processing and letting it go. All this fear in my heart. All this fear in my heart. Doesn't belong trapped in my heart. It doesn't belong trapped in my heart. And I want to let it go. I want to let it go. When I think about this movie title. When I think about this movie title. Fear. Fear. Releasing and processing this fear in my heart. Releasing and processing this fear in my heart. Mm -hmm. Releasing and processing this fear in my heart. Releasing processing this fear in my heart. Letting it go, letting air out of a balloon. Letting it go, letting air out of a balloon. Releasing and processing this fear in my heart. Releasing and processing this fear in my heart. It doesn't belong, belong trapped there. It doesn't belong trapped there. All this fear in my heart. All this fear in my heart. Letting it go. Letting it go. Take a deep breath. So is it fear in your heart or is it something else? Um, keep down grief. Grief. Mm -hmm. Even though I've got this grief in my heart. Even though I've got this grief in my heart. When I think of the movie title. When I think of the movie title. Fear. Fear. I accept myself. I accept myself. And thank my body. And thank my body. For holding on to this grief. For holding on to this grief. Allowing me to get on with things. For allowing me to get on with things. But it's time to process it and let it's it go. It's time to process it and let it go. Even though I've still got some remaining grief. Even though I've still got some remaining grief. In my heart. In my heart. When I think of the movie title. When I think of the movie title. Fear. Fear. I accept myself. I accept myself. Deeply and completely. Deeply and completely. Even though I've still got some remaining grief. Even though I've still got some remaining grief. In my heart. In my heart. I'm allowing my body to process it and let it go. I'm allowing my body to process it and let it go. Mm -hmm. This remaining grief. This remaining grief. This remaining grief in my heart. This remaining grief in my heart. When I think of the movie title. When I think of the movie title. Fear. Fear. Releasing this grief from my heart. I'm releasing this grief from my heart. Processing it now. Processing it now. When I think of the movie title. When I think of the movie title. Releasing this grief. Releasing this grief. Out of my heart. Out of my heart. Okay. So when you think of the movie title, fear. Yeah. How's your body feeling now? Um. Uh, um. A bit more present, mm -hmm. to because it usually goes completely absent. Yeah, okay. So, can you locate that in your body, or is, has it gone down? It's certainly not a 10 anymore, is it? No. Okay. No. So, are you ready to start looking at, at the movie? So, if you're starting at a neutral place mm -hmm. before anything mm -hmm. happened, where are you? Um, I'm um, in my kitchen. Oh, just in my house with two kids, I had a, um, at that stage a, um, I think a, a one and a half year old and a three year old. Mm -hmm. Okay, so starting there in the kitchen. In the kitchen with your two little kids. And with my two little kids. So what happens next? Um, the telephone rings. Mm -hmm. um, what do you hear? when you answer the phone? Um, I hear the lady next door to, in the unit next door to Dad, saying that um, she heard a noise, but um, she didn't know whether Dad was home or not. Mm -hmm. Okay. So when you remember hearing the sound of her voice and the tone of her voice and the way she spoke, and she mm -hmm. said, I heard a noise and I don't know if Dad's home or not, and the feelings that you get in your body when you hear all that, where is it in your body? Um, I was okay with that. Mm -hmm. um, it was very clean. Um, mm -hmm. I just went through a process of, um, do you know if his car's there? Okay. Do you know if he was there last night? Mm -hmm. um, um, okay, I'll come and sort it, I'll come over. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's all clear yeah. until then. Yeah. 
And so then what, you get in the car and you drive over? Um, no, then I, I realised that I don't, um, I've never been, um, I've always, I, I, when my mum passed, I always tried to get Dad to maintain his independence and it wasn't a great concern to me to ever have to have keys for a house. Mm -hmm. just, okay. you know, yeah. That's when I realised, holy crap, <laughs> I can't even get into the house. Okay, so does so, that bring up emotion then when you um, think about that? I can't get into the house? Um, yeah, it was, I can't get into the house and then it was, um, I've got two kids, so I have to drag them out there. What, what happens if something's wrong? Okay, so where, yep, where are you feeling that in your body? Because that's um, the next part now. Um, a weight. Yep. Right, so even though I've got this weight on my shoulders. Even though I've got this weight on my shoulders. I don't have the keys. I don't have the keys. And what if something's wrong? I've got two little kids with me. What if something's wrong? I've got two little kids, kids with me. Yeah. I accept myself. I accept myself deeply and completely. Deeply and completely. Even though I've got this weight on my shoulders. Even though I've got this weight on my shoulders. When I think, what if something's wrong? What if something's wrong? I don't have keys. I don't have keys. And I've got two little kids with me. I've got two little kids with me. And I can feel that weight on my shoulders. I can feel that weight on my shoulders. It's time to release and process this feeling. It's time to release and process this feeling. I accept myself deeply. Driving to Dad. I think about driving to Dad. I don't have keys. No, I have keys. What if something's wrong? What if something's wrong? I've got two little kids with me. I've got two little kids with me. It's time to process and release all it's this feeling. It's time to process and release all this feeling. Out all this weight on my shoulders. All this weight on my shoulders. I accept myself deeply and completely. I accept myself deeply and completely. All this weight on my shoulders. All this weight on my shoulders. What if something's wrong? What if something's wrong? I don't even have keys. I don't even have keys. I've got two little kids with me. I've got two little kids with me. What if something's wrong? What if something's wrong? I've got two little kids with me. I've got two little kids with me. All this weight on my shoulders. All this weight on my shoulders. What if something's wrong? What if something's wrong? Releasing and processing. Releasing and processing. All this weight on my shoulders. All this weight on my shoulders. What if something's wrong? What if something's wrong? Driving to dad's. Driving to dad's. I don't have keys. I don't have keys. Processing and releasing all this weight on my shoulders. Processing and releasing all this weight on my shoulders. Okay, so take a deep breath. All right. So how's the weight on your shoulders? Has that um, gone down? Yeah. Here? Has it moved or? Yeah. It, um, it, there's not a lot of feeling in my body. Okay. So let's go back to the beginning. Yep. So start tapping. So we're at the, you're in your kitchen mm -hmm. with two little kids. Yep. The phone rings mm -hmm. and it's your dad's neighbour and she says she heard a noise and yep. she doesn't know if your dad's home mm -hmm. and you've asked her lots of questions yep. and now you're heading over there with... I'd organised a locksmith to meet me there. Okay. See how more details coming out now? So you organised a locksmith to meet you there mm -hmm. and you're driving there. Mm -hmm. You've got two little kids. What if something's wrong? Mm -hmm. What happens next? Um, crap. Um, I get to Dad's and... Um, the, there's probably about a five minute delay until the locksmith arrives uh -huh. and I'm pacing up and down the outside of the uh -huh. house yep. I'm trying to not look alarmed because I don't want to traumatise my kids because right. they're in the back of the car going, they want to see Poppy. Mm -hmm. Where are you feeling that in your body? Oh crap, I don't know. Um, all um, over, so it's a yeah. panic. Okay. It is a panic, yeah. yeah. All right, so even though I'm outside of the, the house, even though I'm outside of the house, and I've got all this panic in my body, all this panic in my body, and I can feel it in my chest, I can feel it in my chest. I'm pacing up and down, I'm pacing up and down. I accept myself deeply, and I completely. accept myself deeply, completely. even though I'm pacing up and down, I'm pacing up and down, at the front of Dad's. At the side of Dad's At the house. side of Dad's. And I can feel all this panic in my chest. I feel all this panic in my chest. I can't show my panic to my kids. I can't show my panic to the kids. And they're asking, where's Poppy? And they're asking, where's Poppy? I accept myself and all this panic. I accept myself and all this panic. And let my body know it's time to process and release it. Let my body know it's time to process and release it. I accept myself deeply and completely. I accept myself deeply and completely. Top of the head. All this panic. All this panic. It's hard to breathe. It's hard to breathe. I can feel it in my chest. I can feel it in my chest. I'm pacing up and I'm down. Pacing up and down. At the side of Dad. At the side of Dad. And the kids are asking, where's Poppy? The kids are asking, where's Poppy? I can feel all the panic in my chest. I, I can feel all the panic in my chest. I'm thanking my body for holding on to it. 
And thank you, Aunt Lenny, for holding on to me. So I could get on with things. So I could get on with things. And I'm letting my body know it's safe to release I'm it now. my body know it's safe to release it. It needs to be processed now. It needs to be processed now. All that panic in my chest. All that panic in my chest. Processing and releasing that panic in my chest. I'm processing and releasing that panic in my chest. When I remember pacing up and down. When I remember pacing up and down. At the side of Dad's. At the side of Dad's. With the kids asking, where's Poppy? Oh, with the kids asking, where's Poppy? Oh, I'm waiting for the locksmith to arrive. Oh, I'm waiting for the locksmith to arrive. Processing and releasing all that panic. Processing and releasing all that panic. Out of my chest. Out of, it, out of my chest. It doesn't belong trapped there. It doesn't belong trapped there. Processing and releasing all that panic. Processing and releasing all that panic. Sending my chest to peace. I'm sending my chest some peace. Releasing all that panic. Releasing all that panic. Out of my chest. Out of my chest. Out of my body. Out of my body. Thanking my body for holding on to it. Thanking my body for holding on to it. But it's time to process it and let it go now. It's time to process it and let it go now. Releasing that panic out of my chest. Releasing that panic out of my chest. While I was pacing up and down. While I was pacing up and down. Waiting for the locksmith. Waiting for the locksmith. So I take a deep breath. Okay, so while you're at the side of your dad's pacing up and down, and the kids are asking where's Poppy and you're waiting for the locksmith, how's that feeling now? Um, better. Better? Don't mm -hmm. talk about it. Okay. All right, so let's go back to the beginning. So the phone rings, mm -hmm. it's the, your dad's neighbour, Yes. you're talking back and forth, mm -hmm. get in the car, you organise a locksmith mm -hmm. to meet you there, Yes. you've got the kids in the car, <coughs> yes. you get there, mm -hmm. and you're pacing up and down waiting for him. Yeah. Um, I rang my brother Ian, who was, my dad would visit me daily. Mm -hmm. Um, but the other sibling that he would go to would be my brother Ian in Brisbane and so I wasn't quite sure whether Ian had come down to get Dad because mm -hmm. Dad's car was there. Um, so, I will all, and, um, so when I rang Ian, Ian um, said that he was expecting Dad up there today. Okay. So I knew that Dad was inside. Mm -hmm. So what does that feel like when you say that? That feels okay. That feels okay, okay. So what's, what happens next? Um, the locksmith arrives. Mm -hmm. um, by this stage, I've moved the car because I know that Dad's in there, and I didn't want my kids to be um, to see anything that might happen. Mm -hmm. so what's that bringing up? Where are you feeling within your body? Grief. Okay. Where is it? Um, to my shoulder. Okay. Yeah, the breast area. Mm -hmm. All right. So even though I've got this grief, even though I've got this grief in my shoulders. Shoulders. My chest, my breast area. My chest, my breast area. I accept myself deeply and completely. I accept myself deeply and completely. Even though my body's held this grief. Even though my body's held this grief. <coughs> my shoulders, chest. <coughs> my shoulders and chest, breast area. How, helping me to get on with things. Helping me to get on with things. Holding it there and protecting me. Holding it there and protecting me. I'm thanking my body. I'm thanking my body. Letting it know it's time to process letting, it. Now. Letting it know it's time to process it now. All this grief. All this grief. All this grief. All this grief. I moved my car. I moved my car. I didn't want my kids to see it. I didn't want my kids to see it. All this grief processing. All this grief processing. Out of my shoulders, my chest, my breast area. Out of my shoulders, my chest, my breast area. All this grief. All this grief. I wanted to protect my kids. I wanted to protect my kids. Thank you, my body, for protecting me. Thank you, my body, for protecting me. And holding on to this. And hold on to this. So that I could get on with things. So that I could get on with things. But it's time to process and release it now. It's time to process and release it now. It doesn't belong trapped there. It doesn't belong trapped there. And I want to feel peace. I want to feel peace. Mm -hmm. I want to feel peace. I want to feel peace. In my shoulders, my chest, my breast area. In my shoulders, my chest, my breast area. As I'm releasing that remaining grief. As I'm releasing that remaining grief. It doesn't belong trapped. It doesn't belong trapped. I want to process it. I want to process it. Processing and releasing all that remaining grief. Processing and releasing all that remaining grief. When I moved the car. When I moved the car. I didn't want my kids to be traumatised. I didn't want my kids to be traumatised. Releasing and processing uh, the grief. Releasing and processing the grief. Out of my shoulders, chest and breast area. Out of my shoulders, chest and breast area. Sending my chest, shoulders and breast area. Peace. Sending my chest, shoulders, and breast area peace. As I process the remaining grief. As I process the remaining grief. So take a deep breath. <coughs> so does that heart feel okay? Yeah. Right. So 
going back to the beginning. So back all the way. So you tell me the story. Um, I was in my kitchen and I got a phone call. Um, Dad's neighbour had asked, had said that um, she had heard a strange noise, um, but only once. And um, she was concerned that she couldn't get any arousal out of the house. Mm -hmm. So I um, organised going over there on a locksmith to meet me there. Um, I rang my brother Ian to try and get more details on what you know was going on. Um, and I had my kids in the car. Mm -hmm. And you got them? Yeah, I got them. Um, then the locksmith came. Um, and um, opened the door, and that's when I thought, spoke and I swear. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Fuck, I don't know if my dad's alive or dead. Then I don't want to find out. Mm -hmm. So where are you feeling that in your body when you're thinking that thought? It's a shock. It's the over. shock, yeah. Even though I've got this shock all over. Even though I've got this shock all over. When the locksmith opened the door. The locksmith opened and I thought, fuck, I don't know if Dad's alive or dead. I don't know if Dad's alive or dead. And I don't know if I want to find out. I don't want to find out. I accept myself. Accept myself. And all this shock. Sorry. And all this shock. And all this shock. It doesn't belong trapped in my doesn't body. Doesn't belong trapped in my body. And I want to process it and let it go. And I want to process it and let it go. I accept myself and my body. I accept myself and my body. Deeply and completely. Deeply. All this shock as the locksmith opened the door. All this shock as the locksmith opened the door. Processing and releasing it from my body. Processing and releasing it from my body. All this shock. All this shock. All the thoughts. All the thoughts. I don't know if he's dead or alive. I don't know if he's dead or alive. I don't want to find out. I don't want to find out. All this shock in my whole body. All this shock in my whole body. As the locksmith opened the door. As the locksmith opened the door. As I walked in. As I walked in. All this shock in my body. All this shock in my body. I don't know if he's dead or alive. I don't know if he's dead or alive. I don't want to find out. <laughs> I don't want to find out. My whole body's in shock. My whole body's in shock. And I want to process it and let it go. And I don't want to process it and let it go. It doesn't belong trapped here. It doesn't belong trapped here. All this shock in my body. Oh, all this shock in my body. My body held on to it to protect me. My body held on to it to protect me. And I want to release and it now. I want to release it now. Letting my body know it's safe to release all that shock. Letting my body know it's safe to release all that shock. When the locksmith opened the door. When the locksmith opened the door. And I walked in. And I walked in. And I didn't know if Dad was dead or alive. I didn't know whether if Dad was dead or alive. And I didn't want to find out. And I didn't want to find out. Releasing all that shock. Releasing all that shock. Out of my body. Out of my body. And he's dead or alive. I don't know if he's dead or alive. Releasing all that shock. Releasing all that shock. I don't want to find out. I don't want to find out. Releasing all that shock. Releasing all that shock. I don't know if he's dead or alive. I don't know if he's dead or alive. All that shock in my whole body. All that shock in my whole body. Processing and letting it go. Processing and letting it go. It doesn't belong in me. It doesn't belong in me. <coughs> like letting air out of a balloon. Like letting air out of a balloon. I let all the shock out of my body. I let all the shock out of my body. My body deserves peace. My body deserves peace. I want to send it peace. I want to send it peace. As I'm walking in that door. As I'm walking in that door. <coughs> I don't know if he's dead or alive. I don't know if he's dead or alive. Take a deep breath. Okay. So when you're walking in the door mm -hmm. and you don't know if he's dead or alive and you don't want to find out, how's that sitting in your body now? Um, just that part. Just that part that, that's better. Mm -hmm. All right. So if we go back to the beginning mm -hmm. and we fast forward through the phone call, ring the locksmith, mm -hmm. ring Ian, getting there, mm -hmm. pacing out the front, walking in the door, all those thoughts going through your head, I don't know if he's dead or alive. So tapping, what happened next? Um, I knew he was in the bathroom mm -hmm. um, and when I got to the bathroom door I froze mm -hmm. I couldn't walk in. Okay, so stop it. <laughs> Even though I've got this frozen feeling in my body. Even I've got this frozen feeling in my body. When I got to the bathroom door. When I got to the bathroom door. And I couldn't move. I couldn't move. I accept myself. I accept myself. And the way my body's frozen this moment. The way my body's frozen this moment. To protect me in some way. To protect me in some way. I'm letting my body know it's time to process it now. I'm letting my body know it's time to process it now. 
even though I've got this frozen moment, even though I've got this frozen moment, when I was at the bathroom door, when I was at the bathroom door, and I couldn't move, oh, I couldn't move. I accept myself and my body. I accept myself and my body. And let my body know it's time to process. Let it my body me. know it's time to process it without me. This frozen moment. This frozen moment. I was frozen in fear. I was frozen in fear. I got to the bathroom door. I got to the bathroom door. I knew Dad was in the bathroom. I knew Dad was in the bathroom. I got to the bathroom door and I couldn't move. I got to the bathroom door and I couldn't move. I was frozen. I was frozen. Releasing and processing this frozen feeling. Releasing and processing this frozen feeling. This frozen shock. This frozen shock. I was frozen in shock. I was frozen in shock. And I want to release it out of my body. I want to release it out of my body. This frozen shock feeling. This frozen, frozen shock feeling. I was at the bathroom door and I couldn't move. I was at the bathroom door and I couldn't move. It's time for my body to process oh, It's time for my body to process this. This frozen shock feeling. This frozen shock feeling. I want to process it and let it go. I want to process it and let it go. Letting my body know it's safe to let it go. Letting my body know it's safe to let it go now. I'm at the bathroom door. I'm at the bathroom door. I know Dad's in there. I know Dad's in there. Releasing this frozen moment. I'm releasing this frozen moment. This time when I couldn't move. This time when I couldn't move. At the bathroom door. At the bathroom door. Sending my body peace. Sending my body peace. Discharging any remaining frozen moments. Discharging any remaining frozen moments. So take a deep breath. So at the bathroom door there now. Yep. You know Dad's in there. Yeah. How's that feeling? Um, the fear's gone. Um, but whilst doing that, the guilt moved in because I actually couldn't walk in there. Um, mm -hmm. um, I just, I really, deep in my heart, just felt if I stayed where I was, I wouldn't find anything. Okay. So even though I've got this deep guilt in my heart. Even though I've got this guilt in my heart. I really felt that if I didn't walk in. I really felt that if I didn't walk in. I wouldn't find out. I wouldn't find out. I accept myself and all this guilt. I accept myself and all this guilt. And thank my body for holding on to it. And thank my body for holding on to it. And let my body know it's safe to let it go. And let my body know it's safe to let it go. Even though I've got this guilt. Even though I've got this guilt. That I didn't want to walk in there. That I didn't want to walk in there. Because then I wouldn't find out. Then I wouldn't find out. I accept myself and all this guilt. I accept myself and all this guilt. And I want to process it and let it go. I want to process it and let it go. Even though I've still got some remaining guilt. Even though I've still got some remaining guilt. From not wanting to walk into that bathroom. Not wanting to walk into that bathroom. Not wanting to find it. Not wanting to find it. I accept myself. I accept myself. Deeply and completely. And deeply and completely. All this guilt. All this guilt. I didn't want to go in there. 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 All this guilt for not wanting to go in there. for not wanting to go in there. I want to release that guilt. I want to release that guilt. It doesn't serve me any good. It doesn't serve me any good. It serves me no good to hang on to that guilt. It serves me no good to hang on to that guilt. Releasing that guilt. Releasing that guilt. That guilt for not wanting to walk in. That guilt for not wanting to walk in. Not wanting to find it. Not wanting to find it. Releasing that guilt. Releasing that guilt. It doesn't belong in my body. It doesn't belong in my body. Releasing the remaining guilt. Releasing the remaining guilt. The remaining guilt I didn't want to walk in. And the remaining guilt I didn't want to walk in. I didn't want to find out. I didn't want to find out. Releasing that remaining guilt. Releasing that remaining guilt. Sending my body peace. Sending my body peace. As I release the remaining guilt. As I release the remaining guilt. Feeling peace. Feeling peace. As I release the remaining guilt. As I release the remaining guilt. Standing at that bathroom door. Standing at that bathroom door. Deep breath. Okay. So standing at that bathroom door. Yeah. Is the guilt gone now? Yeah, certainly less. Mm -hmm. Okay. So going back to the beginning, mm -hmm. starting from the beginning, all the way through the phone call, mm -hmm. driving there, no keys, getting the locksmith mm -hmm. ringing in, pacing out the front. <coughs> Walking through the door. Yeah. Going to the bathroom. Yeah. Um, I then got the neighbour and asked if she could go in first to tell me whether he was alive or dead. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And um, how's that feeling in your body? It was. It's okay. There was a lot of guilt around that. Yeah. Um, 
And then she said, he's alive, so immediately I um, jumped on the ambulance and rang them. And then I thought, for Christ's sake, just send a friggin' ambulance over here. Don't ask me all these questions, because <laughs> they're really goddamn irrelevant. Just get the bloody thing here. <laughs> <laughs> so what was there? Sorry, ambulance? that's my nursing background <laughs> coming through. I'm thinking, what the heck is wrong with him? I'm not stupid. Just send an ambulance. <laughs> oh, what's his name? You know, what's your birthday like? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So there were, what was there? Were anger and frustration? Or oh, um, no. That's pretty. That's that's lifted. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so that so the ambulance came. Yeah, the ambulance came. Um, by that stage, once I got onto the ambulance, and, and my frustration was, I need to get in to see Dad. Stop asking all these stupid questions. Mm -hmm. um, I was right then. Once I got in to see Dad. Um, I was right then once I, I, I was right once he, he was at the hospital, it was just the general concerns that that was okay. Mm -hmm. um, my next level of shock came, um, the ne I had um, organised a commercial cleaner to come in and clean the carpet because funnily enough I didn't want to stand there and scrub my dad's blood out mm -hmm. of the I can imagine. And then my brothers started ringing me up, abusing me, going, why are you getting commercial cleaner in? Mm -hmm. like, so it was their abuse um, that made okay. thinking mm -hmm. that I should be in there doing it. Okay, so when you heard your brother ring you mm -hmm. and that abuse, the sound yeah. of his voice and what he said, mm -hmm. where do you feel that in your body? Um, it's a shock again. Mm -hmm. So even though I've got this shock in my body, even though I've got this shock in my body, when I can hear my brother's abuse, when I can hear my brother's abuse, and I can feel all the guilt, and I can feel all the guilt, I accept myself, I accept myself, and my body, and my body, and I'm letting my body know it's time to process this. I'm letting my body know it's time to process this. As I remember hearing my brother's abusive voice, as I remember hearing my brother's questioning voice. Mm. Abusing me. Abusing me. Asking me all these questions. Asking me all these questions. All this guilt in my body. All this guilt in my body. I accept myself deeply. In I accept myself deeply. Completely. I can still hear my brother's voice. I can still hear my brother's voice. All those questions. All those questions. The guilt I'm feeling. The guilt I'm feeling. All those questions. All those questions. I can still hear his voice. I can still hear his voice. Asking me why I'm not cleaning it. Asking me why I'm not cleaning it. Asking me why I'm getting a commercial cleaner. Why I'm getting a commercial cleaner in and who's going to pay for it? And who's going to pay for it? And who's going to pay for it? I can still what? hear my brother's questions. Who cares? Um, I can still hear my brother's questions. And all the guilt it's bringing up in me. And all the, the confusion, confusion it's bringing up in me. Mm -hmm. Yep. I can feel the shock in my body. I can feel the shock in my body. All this confusion. All this confusion. Why is he asking me all these questions? Why is he? Why does he care? Mm -hmm. Why does he care? Why does he care? All this confusion. All this confusion. I can still hear his questions. I can still hear his questions. All this confusion. All this confusion. All these emotions in my body. All these emotions in my body. I want to process them and let them go. I want to process them and let them go. They serve me no good. They to serve keep me them. no good to keep them. And I want to let them go. I want to let them go. Processing them out of my body. Processing them out of my body. Even when I remember hearing my brother's voice. Even when I he remember hearing my brother's voice. Hearing all his questions. Hearing all his questions. Releasing all my confusion. Releasing all my confusion. All my frustration. All my frustration. All my anger. All my anger. All my guilt. All my guilt. Releasing all my reactions to my brother's voice. Releasing all my reactions to my brother's voice. All his questions. All his questions. Sending my body peace. Sending my body peace. Mm -hmm. Is that for there? Yep. When you remember hearing <laughs> his voice and, yep. and the questions he was asking, mm -hmm. why are you getting commercial clean or why aren't you doing it? Who's going to pay for mm -hmm. it? It's not registering with you now. Okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. All right, so from the beginning all the way through. Um, the, the next door neighbour rang me and the day getting put into the ambulance. Um, the neighbour went and actually went and entertained my kids. Oh, good. Um, so that was okay. Um, sorted that out. Um, the whole time I was dealing with the ambulance and that, my brother was continually ringing me and I'm thinking, for far out, I've got a bit on my plate. I'll deal with you later. Mm -hmm. um, and um, Is that bringing anything up? No, just, 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 just annoying sort of thing, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
their games. Um, yeah. Um, and then um, Dad going to hospital, um, deal, you know, organ then organising a cleaner. And I did that because um, Mum wouldn't want that left in the house. Mm. Um, and, but the next morning I turned up when I had the cleaner booked mm -hmm. and my two brothers were sitting, now the house was locked, two brothers were sitting in the house waiting for me. Mm -hmm. And what's that bringing up? Well, I didn't understand why they were in Mum and Dad's house. Mm -hmm. uh, um, mm -hmm. They're going through all Mum and Dad's stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay. So even though... Even though... You know, I got there. I got there. My two brothers were sitting in the house. My two brothers were sitting in the house. And I... Don't know why they were going through mum and dad's stuff. I don't know why they were going through mum and dad's stuff. And it brings up all this emotion. Oh, it brings up all this emotion. I accept myself. I accept myself. And my body. And my body. And I'm letting my body know it's safe to let it go now. And I'm letting my body, letting, letting my body know it's safe to let it go now. And my brothers, two of my brothers were sitting in the house. Two of my brothers were sitting in the house. I don't know why they were in there. I don't know why they were in there. Going through mum and dad's stuff. Going through mum and dad's stuff. And it brings up all this emotion. It brings up all this emotion. <coughs> all this emotion. All this emotion. Why are they going through mum and dad's stuff? Why are they going through mum and dad's stuff? Why are they in the house going through mum and dad's stuff? Why are they in the house going through mum and dad's stuff? Releasing all this emotion. Releasing all this emotion. It serves me no good to hold on to it. it serves me no good to hold on to it. And I want to let it go. And I want to let it go. All this emotion trapped in my body. All this emotion trapped in my body. When I remember... Seeing my brothers in the house. Seeing my brothers in the house. Going through mum and dad's stuff. Going through mum and dad's stuff. I want to let it go. I want to let it go. Releasing it from my body. Releasing it from my body. Even when I remember seeing my brothers. Even when I remember seeing my brothers. In the house. In the house. Going through mum and dad's stuff. Going through mum and dad's stuff. Releasing it out of my body. Releasing it out of my body. <laughs> so there they are, in there. <laughs> going through mum and dad's stuff. <laughs> Anything else? Um, they, uh, they were just being really covert, didn't speak to me. Um, just, um, I now know what it was about. I, Dad, Dad um, had short-term um, dementia, so he shortly, you know, recalling things and things like that. And um, <sighs> Mum covered a lot of the stuff. And then when Dad passed away, it all was revealed. Mm -hmm. And um, I know it was about the fact that Mum had... Um, I had gone and set up automatic direct deposits so that Dad didn't... Mum paid all the bills. Mm. But Dad didn't understand where the money was going. And, and he had told my brothers that I had done it, but we'd done it jointly together at the bank. So my brothers thought that I was there taking mm. all Dad's money, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. even though... So it was all sorted out. No, they no, they still didn't know. They still didn't believe it. They thought they 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 still to this day, even though there's bank statements. Mm. They if Dad took five hundred dollars out of the bank to go and do something with, they still think I took it. Mm -hmm. Which okay, is so there's some more stuff to work on. There is loads but basically, more stuff. Basically, but that, the trauma that trauma of that, of that place, it, yeah, it's, it's much better. Gone. Yeah. Okay. Good. So could you see how we went through bits and she was releasing and releasing yeah. and releasing, and then back to the beginning, and more details would come up, mm. or less details because there was no trauma around the yeah. details anymore. Mm -hmm. I found one whilst going through it, uh, it would shift really quickly, and I moved straight into the next shot. Yes. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Lovely. Thank you.